Now, we're going to try Dragon Slayer Part 2. Robert the Strong. I learned the hard way that this boss is a monster. He will destroy you if you are low level. Um, and when I say he will destroy you, I mean he will literally destroy you. Like, it's it's ridiculous. This man's making 36s. He even hit a 67. I mean, he was wrecking the crap out of me. I'm like, what? What? Why? Why you want to do me like that? You know, like, it was it was bad for me, man. Like, I went in there. It was like a pit bull versus a chihuahua. Um, I mean, I am quite a lower level than him, but good God. I mean, that, that was just, that was one of the most horrific beatings I've ever suffered in the name of this game. I mean, I'm like, what? And they're like, why? But it was a beating from another world it was it was it was unearthly how bad he beat me down um so i decided to change up my strategy this one i've taken two losses cost me 200k and i went and bought me a little weapon that i thought about which is um this little obby mace um i know this weakness is crush what i'm hoping for is that um that little Ivy Mace can actually do some serious damage to him. Um, I mean, he's, he's he's a beast. I mean, there's no doubt about it. I might actually have to level up my character. Is what I'm looking at, and um, I didn't want to do that, but I might have to. So I want to try this quest at level 89. And, but man, I'm telling you, this is something else. I ain't, I ain't like them guys to get on there and and just study the game to the T and. And just do their best at, at, at being the most perfect game, period. I just go for what I know. And um, I'm trying that. And, and he, he put a beating on me. But we're going to try that again. Um, I'm not planning on taking another beat down. Um, what I am planning on doing is winning. So let's hope that um, it's so hard to see the screen on this little phone. We're hoping that we do it this time. We, we're going to hope that we can, we can put a beating that he's never witnessed before in his life on him. Oh, um, you know, I, at the minimum, what I might end up just doing is just going and getting seventy prayer, cause um, I mean, I'm gonna get it anyways. And I've got the stuff to get it. I just don't feel like grinding that ecto altar. <sighs> I'm actually scared to go in this fight. Oh, there we go. Now, hopefully, God will be on my side. Things are going a lot better for me this game. If if he does that little um, calling of the dragon, you want to try to get behind one of these pillars, or you will get, I mean, brutally fucked. Like I almost just got done, because I probably would have been dead, because he's hitting up to a 67 that I've seen from that freaking move, and I mean, and I wasn't expecting it. I mean. I wonder if he's dropping stats. Nah, he ain't dropping stats, but he is whooping ass. Alright, let's let's get the hell up out of there. Let's get the hell up out of there. You see what I'm saying? He's knocking shit loose. He's knocking heads loose. But it doesn't look like he drops stats, but he puts a beating on you. You definitely want to use a crush weapon.
As you see, he will teleport you back out there to take some more punishment. He's a belligerent. With Thank God for the ring of suffering. You're going to need some heavy gear if you do this at a low level. But as you see, I did it. Man, that was stressful, man. I mean, a boss cost me like 200k and making me have to buy a freaking 200k weapon to, to beat him. I'm like, dude. But it's all right. Now we get to look at this. These dragons are the ones that um, created the dragons, to my understanding. Like a vulture lizard. And finally, we made it through that. I mean, this that was stressful. I mean, there goes you a low-level quest guide for that. As I was saying before, you want to be careful. Um, you you really want to just watch that special move because that special move is it's not gonna. It's, there's one thing it's not gonna hit a zero. It's gonna hit really high every time. Um, highest it hit on me was a 67. Um, I believe that the max hit that was described online was a whole lot lower than that. So you want to be prepared for at least a 67 to smack you. Um, unless I was just so unlucky that I got a 67 smacked on me. But um, you know you want to dodge that. Don't try to vengeance it. It ain't worth it if you're a low level. Because um, as you see, I got 95 mage, and, and it's, it's just not going to happen. Um, you want to just get behind the pillar. Um, as soon as you see words come up, run. Um, after that, you will be teleported back to him. So be prepared to fight. If you get hit by his specialist, not only is it going to smack you really hard, but it's going to knock your prayer off and um, leave you vulnerable. So if you don't take and um, get on it immediately, you're going to die as soon as you come out from behind that pillar. Um, just watch that. Watch that attack. Get away from that attack. And do everything you can to not get hit by it. And you should be good. Make sure you've got a good crush weapon. Um, I'm using the full obsidian with the um, with the, the Berserker um, necklace boost. And I also got the Ring of Suffering. And I brought me a blessing to try to help out with the prayer bonus. Um, so that there. This little, little Betty boy right here. This little little mean beast right here. This, this ties a hard cat on it's pretty good as you can see I'm combat level 89 um, as you can see my stats are not too great um, I'm not really planning on being a melee type on here I'm planning on being more of a um, range and mage and, and um, hopefully I'll have me some PK videos this is my main so hoping that I can I can bring these stats up on it because I'm planning on getting base 70 which I'm pretty close so just got a few more skills to get to 70 and boom here we go I'm base 50 I guess you could say because of the 54 prayer which won't be for long because I do have exactly what it takes to get my prayer up as you see I've got those bones um, and I'm going to be hitting up that Ecto altar because I just don't like the Gilded altar so much I get more relaxation at the Ecto altar I don't got a lot of people around me and I'm happy there so um, Ecto altar will be the way that I go with it um, I thank you all for watching uh, another low level boss takedown you know did better lower level than usual um, even though I do got some pretty extravagant stats this um, would be very awesome for somebody that had like 66 defense 78 strength and 61 attack and 54 prayer and 80 HP because um, I didn't use my range on my mage which that's why I'm more stronger in those areas but I thank you all for watching um, please like and subscribe I need as many subscribers as possible because um, as it comes to belief I will not be able to uh, make videos well, a whole lot of videos much longer because um, I will be healing up soon, I'm hoping. And um, once I heal up, I'm, I'm hoping to get back to work. Um, I do me some physical therapy and stuff, so I'm going to be real busy. And, and plus, life has been hitting it hard on me, so I've been really busy with that too. And I'm um, handling business, you know. But um, I'd appreciate it a whole lot if you liked and subscribed. Um, I just I try my best at the videos, you know. I don't got a whole lot of equipment or nothing. I can't really afford all that stuff, so I'm sorry if my video isn't to your standard so um, if you do have tips to help me become better at making videos um, I'm more than happy to hear everything that you have to offer that can help me edit the videos and make the videos better um, 
I just really want to just help everybody be able to take and, and do the quest if they're on lower level and give them the opportunity to get out there and, and see how bad it is and hard it is to actually get a beating on there and, and you know and just check it out. If you would like to see the video where um, I lost the, the few matches I did, I ended up losing two times consecutively. Um, if you would like to see that video, just drop a comment and I will upload that video for you. And um, if you're subscribed, you will see when I upload that video. I did get quite frustrated on that video, so I do apologize for the speech I used on it. Um, on this one, I, I kept my cool. I tried to keep a well-tempered mind, and I kind of knew exactly what I was going for. I planned it out and, and thought to myself, I had to take a break off the game for a little minute and came back and knocked it out. Um, but anyways, I thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions, just um, leave those questions in the comments, and I'll try to direct you bestly to whatever part you might have missed, or um, we'll further explain it to you to help you more better understand it. Um, I thank you all for watching, and you have a very wonderful day, or night, or um, you know whatever time it is, where yet you just have a, a very nice whatever it is going, and, um, and I wish you all the best, and I just need everybody's support, and all my fans' support, and I thank you all, and, um, and that's, there we go. Thanks for watching, and have a very wonderful day.